Hi everyone, welcome to the first part of our beginner's guide on growing orchids. Today we're going to talk about plant families, focusing on the Orchidacea family which gives us the orchid plant. A little later we'll give examples to orchid types and we'll even finish with a symphony. Isn't that cool? Let's get started. Sometimes botanists are undecided concerning plant families. For example, daisies and sunflowers are in both the Astacea and Compositea families. These are not two different families, but the same family. The family name is just different. I know it's confusing. As for orchids, they belong to one family and have descriptive, easy to understand name, Orchidacea. The Orchidacea family contains more than 20,000 species. Therefore, it is the second largest family of flowering plants after the Astacea. Orchids have a worldwide distribution. You may even know the orchid association with Greek mythology, Aphrodite and Cyprus. However, Costa Rica, New Zealand, and Sri Lanka have orchid myths. The white orchid legend is associated with a search in South America. Orchids exist as five types, epiphytes, lithophytes, monopodial, sympodial, and terrestrial. Epiphytes get their nutrients from the air and rain. Lithophytes have their roots attached to rocks. Monopodial orchids grow upward. Sympodial orchids grow outward, whereas the other orchids grow wild in nature. Here are some names for monopodial type orchids. Palanephosis amablis, Palanephosis ambonesis, Palanephosis ludemaniana, Palanephosis schilleriana, Brassavola cuculata, Brassavola digbiana, Brassavola nodosa. And believe me, there are many, many more. We're not going to go through all of them. Here are some examples for hybrids Cattleya, Cambidium, Dendobium, Mastevalia, Miltonia, Papiopedilium, and many, many more. If you grow a specially exciting orchid, you may want to hire a musical composer to create a song for it. An orchestra could possibly pay your song. Then you will have an orchestra for your orchid. Follow us for the second part of our beginner's guide to growing orchids. Bye!